Uh, so my name is Anna Malai. Uh, I, I work for the Karnataka Police. I belong to the Indian Police Service. I'm an ASP here, Assistant Superintendent of Police. I'm in based out of Udipi district. Uh, so I take, up a, take care of a subdivision called Karkala, about seven police stations I look after. So for people who are not aware of Karkala, it's, it's near the guards uh, in the Udipi district and uh, which has got a slightly naxal problem also. And my day-to-day -day work comprises of uh, dealing with the left-wing extremism uh, issues, uh, issues of traffic, especially crimes. I look out for all these issues. Uh, not exactly the way the GAS, uh, we have used it, but Google Maps of, of and on we use it. But uh, uh, we didn't use much of analysis. It's, it's a basic uh, uh, data which we generate. We look at the data manually, and we do some analysis in Excel. We're doing that kind of uh, this thing. So we took help of map, but not exactly the full spectrum of GIS. The power of GIS is really amazing, especially the analytic power. And uh, especially Polis as an organization, if you look at it, we, we collect, we generate tons of data, tons of data we generate. Because all of our vehicles are enabled with GPS. Every crime spot we go, we take the lat long uh, position, uh, especially with the help of the new uh, interface that is available, either with the help of a handheld GPS which people move. We generate loads of data. But the problem till now was we were not analyzing it properly to derive a meaningful conclusion from it. Now, especially the course that I have done now in the past three, four days, uh, we got a bird's eye view of what can happen when all those data is put into action. I'm pretty sure uh, uh, when, when we analyze those data, data, we can make a lot of meaningful decisions. Where, where exactly to put our finite resources, where exactly to place them, especially in a big bandobast or a mela when somebody comes when the crowd is of higher order especially where are the where are the hot spots the areas where there might be potential problems we can identify that and also we have historical data uh, i think uh, there is something called ncrb in india which actually collects data on behalf of the indian government and we have historical data and through which we can do a lot of crime mapping i think we can we can predict incident I think sky is the limit. Once we uh, really believe what the analyzing power of GIS can give us, I think we can do wonders with it. I think it's a fabulous place. Uh, uh, IHS is really a tremendous organization. The way I think, uh, really good place. Uh, what I really amazed is the uh, the the, en the energy level of the faculty. Uh, great energy level. Uh, they they own it. They they you know they feel it and teach us. And furthermore, I think most of the people are masters in that area. Uh, you know, you ask a small, small nitty gritties, I think they're able to comfortably, conveniently explain it. I think I really like the way, especially the whole campus, the, 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 the energy surrounding it, uh, the, you know, the, the people are absolutely lovely. Uh, I think next opportunity they're going to come, to come, to come like to come back here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now, uh, I think Polis, it, it's, a, it's a different animal from other organizations if you look at it. Now, uh, we have different layers of hierarchy. Yeah. We need more people to come and do it. Maybe it be starting from the police constable to the DG. A lot of people have to do it because we all make different decisions uh, at different points of time. Uh, a, a decision that a constable makes day in and day out is absolutely different from a supervisor officer like me who makes it. So, we should not uh, stop this training to officers like me. I think it's important that we bring all our men here. Yeah. And we tell them what exactly, you know, how beautiful the world outside is, especially when technology is coupled with it. The wonders that people can do in the field is, you know, really great. I think everybody should experience it. I, I think I should, I should uh, congratulate this institute. I think it's, uh, it's a new beginning for you, especially. Uh, I think you have made a lot of strides. I, I follow this institute on the web, uh, especially. Uh, I think I should uh, say the best wishes for you, you know, to go to the next level. And probably this should uh, serve as a place where cutting edge research happens uh, uh, for how the city should grow in the future. I think uh, a model city, how it should be. I think you should do a lot of research and you should give us, uh, you know, solutions also, even for polis, how we should function.